Hello everyone and welcome to my channel. Hope you all are doing good and today my son is going to share a recipe that how he made a homemade chocolate. So let's see. Welcome to my mom's channel. I'm using her channel for today to make homemade chocolate. If you're in quarantine, so you don't have to go to the store and get sick. You need half a teacup of coconut oil, this much sugar, four spoons of sugar, four spoons of milk powder, and four spoons of cocoa powder. And you also need a stove and get the small spoon to mix everything in this big bowl. You need a big one. And I'm gonna put this glass thing in the stove. My mom is here with me. She's gonna do it for safety reasons. Yeah! Uh, but this is one of those very big and thick um, glass containers, so it's not gonna break or shatter or explode, hopefully. <laughs> All of this, all of this milk powder, and now the sugar, which is my main ingredient. Not the coconut oil, that will be later. First, we need to mix these ingredients and mix it and make one big, weird brown, sugary powder. Weird. Ah! Also, make sure to subscribe to the channel Dragon Dude 100, Dragon, and then Space Bar, and then Dude 100. And subscribe to the channel that has a picture of a uh, Roblox okay. figure. Okay, now one thing. You're on my channel, Cooking, and you're talking about your channel. I don't care. Nobody watches my videos. <laughs> I want them to. And everybody watches your channel, Mom. Uh-oh. Okay, so let's take this one now because it's mixed enough. Come on. Okay. This one. Mom, you have to do it for safety reasons. Duh. Okay, so this one is right here. The water is boiling. And like Not boiling, but it's hot. And what we have to do? Come on. Take your seat. I'm here, don't worry. Coconut oil and pour it in this glass container. Inside, slowly, yeah. Yeah, I tried. You don't have to do from the top. It's gonna spill on you, so. I tried, mom. Okay, and remember what I said, so Type in dragon, click space bar, and then do Look 100. Here. And then, mom, stop. And subscribe to my channel, which is superior to this one. Dragon, space bar, dude 100. My profile picture is a Roblox character. Boom. Samuk say Miksai. And you have to put all of this, you know the coconut oil? We have to put a lot of this powder. We have to put a lot of the sugar, a lot of the milk powder, and cocoa if we want it to be chocolate. But slowly and one by one. Yes, one by one. So mix it. Okay. Because we need the chocolate to be thick and not watery because nobody likes watery chocolate. Agan, Tharwaiga, and uh, remember you have to cook for five to six minutes on the medium heat mode until the chocolate thing gets thick enough. So you have to keep stirring it and just let it get thicker. I can feel it getting a little bit thicker. It's been a few minutes. Um, now it should look something like this, something like that. So as long as, as, long as it's um, not so powdery, it will be good to go. And 
to me it looks like it's not too powdery but we're just gonna mix it a little tiny bit more just to just in case there's a little bit powder but uh there's one condition you have to um you know uh wait until it becomes room temperature room temperature because if you put it while it's just hot boiling then the container will be messed up and it will take longer and way longer to cool down and freeze so you must wait until it becomes room temperature and then that's how you know that it is done. so uh so uh, okay you can put in any container which is easy to get the chocolate out of. I'm using silicone so it is easy to get the chocolate pieces out. But you can use any type of container as long as you can get the chocolate pieces out extremely easily. But I would recommend silicone. So like I said, wait for it to become room temperature and then put it in the freezer so that's what i'm doing right now we have to wait a little bit until it's room temperature and then we will put this in the freezer with the tops on and then later we will check on it and it will become chocolate And that's how you make homemade chocolate without having to go anywhere to get it. And it's an easy recipe. Please try it. And let me know in the comments section down below if you enjoyed the recipe. And thank you for watching.